Hey everybody, Dr. Wessel Couch here with another math and Minecraft episode. Today, we're going to approximate a very obscure mathematical constant using Minecraft. All right, let's get started. Consider the number whose binary expansion is 0.1 repeating plus 0.01 repeating plus 0.001 repeating, and so on. This number is called the erdos borwein constant. It's denoted by capital E and has the value of 1.6067. This is an irrational number, so its decimal expansion goes on forever. Note that the binary number point, and now we'll have n minus one zeros followed by a one repeating is equal to 1 over 2 to the n plus 1 over 2 to the n squared plus 1 over 2 to the n to the third and so forth. This is a geometric series so its value is easy to compute. It's 1 over 2 to the n over 1 minus 1 over 2 to the n which simplifies to 1 over 2 to the n minus 1. So the erdos borwein constant is equal to the sum from n equals 1 to infinity of 1 over 2 to the n minus 1. It's the sum of the reciprocals of the Mersenne numbers. We'll use the eighth partial sum to approximate this constant. The Minecraft mechanic we're going to use to approximate the erdos borwein constant is the conversion of villagers into zombie villagers. When a drowned attacks a villager, there's a 50% chance that it gets converted to a zombie villager if you're playing on normal difficulty. Here, the drowns killed both of the villagers, but we could do this again. And we'll see that 50% of the time, the villagers will turn into zombie villagers. So here, both of them converted to zombie villagers. So I'm, I made a redstone device to check whether both are converted to zombie villagers or both are killed. If both are converted to zombie villagers, when this redstone is activated, this dropper will be activated and will put an item in this chest. Similarly, if both villagers die when the redstone is activated, an item will be put in this chest, which I marked by red. To clarify, since we started with two villagers in this example, one-fourth of the time they both die, and one-fourth of the time they both get converted. In the remaining two-fourths of the time, one dies and one is converted. To get the value of 1 over 2 to the n minus 1, we will spawn in n villagers, and divide the number of times all n are converted by the number of times at least one villager is converted. All n will convert with probability 1 over 2 to the n, and at least one will convert with probability of 1 minus 1 over 2 to the n. And we saw earlier that 1 over 2 to the n divided by 1 minus 1 over 2 to the n is equal to 1 over 2 to the n minus 1. So we will compute this for n equals 1, 2, and all the way up to 8. Without further ado, let's approximate the erdos borwein constant. If this doesn't make you love math, then I don't know what would. All right, let's see how we did. Here are the results from the approximation. And let me explain to you how to interpret these data. Villagers were spawned in a total of 576 times. 
Now let's take a look at this section here. The number 75 means out of those 576 times, 75 of those times, all of the villagers were converted to zombie villagers. And 73 times, all of them died. So this gives our approximation for 1 over 2 to the third minus 1 as 75 over 576 minus 73. We'll do this computation for all eight of the sections. Recall that the value of the erdos borwein constant is 1.6067. And our machine gives this as our approximation for E, which simplifies to the erdos borwein constant is approximately equal to 1.5995 five, only off by 0.45%. I can't believe it. Another machine that is shockingly accurate. Is there anything that Minecraft can't do? Anyway, I had a lot of fun making this episode. Let me know in the comments if there's any other mathematical constants you'd like to see me approximate in Minecraft, or if there's any math topics you'd like to see. I always love making these episodes and share this video with your friends. If you're new to the channel, take a look at the playlist in the description. There's a lot of old math and Minecraft videos that I think you'd really like to watch. All right, smash the like button before you get out of here. Bye bye.